Have you ever wondered what it takes to get a company from zero all the way up to $100,000 per month in profit? This is actually profit, not revenue. And more importantly, have you ever wondered how you can do this for free? Yes, I did this for, for completely free. And in this video, I'm going to take you through exactly how I did this and how I built one of my businesses from zero all the way up to $100,000 per month in profit. And it's really interesting. So you're going to want to stay and watch this video because I'm going to take you through exactly how I did this and how it was possible to make this money online. What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. Now I've been stuck in quarantine for like five or six weeks now. It's driving me crazy. I need some McDonald's. I need a haircut, but I've utilized this time to look at my businesses online. So if you don't know who I am, I do stuff online. I have softwares and I promote products online and I primarily make my money online, make do a full-time living online. Now I was going through my businesses and um, just tweaking them and messing around. And I noticed that one of them, we hit $100,000 this month from one of our businesses. And I wanna actually explain to you how I built this business up because I feel that it's important if you're trying to make money online to see what other people have done and how they've built their business up to make money in line as well. Now I realize $100,000 is a huge amount of money, but ultimately that's really where people want to be. They want to be making $100,000 a year, maybe $100,000 a month. I never thought this business would ever hit $100,000 per month, but we have put a lot of work into it to get it to this point. This isn't a get rich quick scheme or anything like that. This did take time to do this. And I'm going to explain to you exactly how I did it step by step and kind of like really just try and do it in the best way possible so you understand how an online business works and what's important in an online business, what you need, what you don't need, and what you and, and what to kind of focus your time on because a lot of people focus their time on heaps of different stuff. You need to focus your time on things in a specific way, in a specific order to be successful online. Now with this particular business or method, if you want to call it, I didn't use any advertising. So the traffic was 100% free. I've not spent a dime on traffic to this particular business. And I usually, in most cases, so I do run ads for some of my other businesses, like uh, selling courses and stuff. But ultimately, I like free traffic because it's high converting and obviously it's free. And it's more passive than paid advertising. With paid advertising, once you stop, the money stops coming in. With the traffic method that I use for this business, the money just builds up and kind of compounds as time goes on, as it has in this case. So let's jump straight into this one, guys, and make sure you drop a like on this video because there's a lot of value in this video. The first thing you need to kind of look at if you want to uh, make money online or start, or start a business is you need to understand that the number one thing that you need to really focus on is traffic, okay? That's the number one thing you need to focus on. Like for example, if I build a course or a webinar or I'm building a website or a funnel, I never really perfect the funnel or the website or anything until I'm getting traffic. Like let's say for example, I'll run advertising for something. I'll do the worst funnel and I'll just start throwing money at ads to get people into that funnel. Then I'll start to optimize. It's the same with this particular business model that I'm talking about. So the first thing that I did with this business, guys, is simple. I decided that I wanted to build up a free traffic source. I didn't care what, how I made the money at this point. I just wanted to build up a free traffic source. Now, the best way, in my opinion, to do that is not things like YouTube and stuff like that, because I understand a lot of people don't like um, doing YouTube. For this um, business, I built up, I started a website basically blogging about the specific topic that I wanted to blog about. And right now we're at around about 3,000 visits per day. Now, what I do when I start this blog or the, these types of blogs, I have quite a few blogs. This is just one of them in this particular business. So we have a couple of blogs. But what I do is I just start blogging about things. I go and see what my competitors, competitors are doing. I go and kind of like, I don't copy them, but we do structures and articles similar to theirs. And we just focus on getting the traffic and then we worry about monetizing later. Now, how we get the traffic is simple. We structure articles, we talk about specific topics, uh, specific products, and we structure articles in a way that get people to click and they keep clicking through our website. Now, the reason we wanna do this is because it gives Google good, good signals and it brings our website up in the ranks and we get more clicks and stuff like that. And then Google thinks, oh, okay, people are liking this website, we're gonna send more traffic to them because we're gonna put them higher up in the Google ranks. We use um, Google traffic for this, free Google traffic. Now you might be thinking this isn't really free because you paid for a website. 
The website is nothing. It's like three or four dollars per month. So I'm not going to count that um, because most mainly when you do when you start a business online, it's the traffic's the most important part. So free or paid, and we used free traffic for this method. Now for the first kind of like three or four months, we just focused on the traffic and that was it. The next step was how are we gonna make money from this website? How are we gonna monetize it? Now luckily for me, I actually had a software that I'd already created in this niche. So around about 20% of the money, so around about 20 to $30,000 per month is from a software that I created. But let's just put that aside because I know that most of you guys, like 99% of you guys, have no interest in starting a software. So let's just put that aside. What we also did is we did a method called affiliate marketing. So we went and found products in the niche. Now, we didn't just find products and spread those products all over the website. We found products specific to specific articles. So for example, if we have an article about how to create a Shopify store, we would go and sign up to the Shopify affiliate program and we would put links in that specific article. If we had another article, the best um, apps for making money online, for example, we would go and sign up. We would have a list of like nine applications and we would go and sign up to every single affiliate program for those apps and we would put links in. We actually have an affiliate link manager. That's how many affiliate links we have. And we would go and put affiliate links into those articles. And then another example is we might have an article about how to start a blog and we might have a link to a website where people can start a blog. So we literally have thousands of affiliate links. But you've got to realize that if even, let's say, a thousand of those affiliate links got clicks, one click per day, that's a thousand clicks to those affiliate links every single day. Now, what happens is when people go and sign up, we get a commission. Now, this is probably the best way, in my opinion, to make money online because you don't need to actually go out and create your own product. Now, what I want to do real quick is I want to show you something that's probably going to be the most important thing you're ever going to see when it comes to making money online. And this is what I call the passive income line. So let's just um, say, for example, you'll see this in a second. So let's just say um, on, I don't know if you can see that right now. Let's just say um, on day, on month one, right? You put in a lot of work. So basically for, for uh, month one to month four, okay? Let's say, and we'll get this color here, month one to month four, hopefully you can see that. You put in a lot of work, okay? So you do heaps of articles and and you just write a lot of content, okay? You just write a lot of of content. Now, what happens is in in this period of time, you're you're making no money, okay? You're you're making basically zero dollars, but that's fine because you will make a lot more money as time goes on, okay? So you're making no money here. Then what happens is is um, this is the line. So day one, and to month to month four. What happens is your work that you put in is the is the red pen. The work that you put in goes up and up and up and up, but then it starts to kind of flatten off, and then it starts to go down. Okay, because you don't need to write as many um, articles. But what then happens is this: once you start to monetize your articles, you start to put links in, you start to um, you know, maybe like th- this works for anything if you have your own product or anything, okay? With, but the main thing is the traffic. What happens then is you basically make um, no money, okay? So, so the green line is money. You make no money. But then all of a sudden you make $10 maybe. And then you might make $30. Then you might make another $10. But the money goes up and the work goes down and then it crosses over. And what I mean by that, hopefully you can see that. And what I mean by that, it's kind of important to understand is that it's it's a passive income system. So you put in a lot of work at the beginning and then what Google does is our our website basically went from like, uh, I'll try to put a graph on the screen. It went from like really, really steady and we have a bit of a dip because our pixel messed up, but it was really, really, really steady. And then it just goes up and up and up and now it's going up even more. And that's because we haven't actually written any content for this website for about six months. But what happens is Google says, hey, this site, everyone likes this site and it gets stronger and stronger and stronger and they put it up in the rankings and we've done less work we've done less work in the last six months than we did in the first six months we've done heaps of work in the first six months but we're making more money now 
our money has tripled, quadrupled, because Google's putting us up in the rankings more. Now, of course, we could keep doing work, don't get me wrong, and we, could, and, and, and we are gonna start doing more work soon and keep building and building and building and building it stronger, but the point is, you don't actually, we don't actually need to. We could let this website run as it is now and we'll potentially keep making $100,000 a month. Now, I don't think we would because it would probably plateau at some point, but the most important thing to worry about when starting a business online, if you're doing uh, free traffic, is that you want to do content on this website. Okay, I might put a thing up on the screen if, if this doesn't work. So you're gonna have your content, but you're, the, a kind of a new thing that we've been doing, um, my red one, what we've been doing is we've been putting links in the content here that go to other pages on our website and it keeps people on the website. So when people go to this website, they click these other links and they stay on the website instead of leaving straight away. This is, the, this is pretty much the number one thing that's helped us grow our affiliate marketing website and we also make money from software on it to $100,000 per month in profit. This is profit. We have not spent any money on this website apart from the hosting fees, which I'm not going to be counting. And more importantly, what we do is we target low-hanging fruits. So um, let's say, for I'm gonna give you an example. I don't wanna share the website because last time I did that, people just copied it. But let me kind of share an example um, with you, okay? If I was going to go and do an article on how to create a landing page and promote a landing page product, okay? Instead of doing how to create a landing page, I would do how to create, sorry, it's really hard to uh, write like this, a landing page, page for beginners. Then I would make that literally the best article on how to create a landing page for beginners. Most people do how to create a landing page. How to create a landing page in 2020. Everybody's doing that. You need to go for those low-hanging fruit keywords um, that people are searching for. So that, my friends, is how I built a website or an online business from zero all the way up to $100,000 per month in profit. Now, this did take a long time to um, do. We started this website about 18 months ago, but we only really started getting traffic around about a year ago. It does take quite a bit of time. Now, if you want to learn more about how you can start your own business and how you can get to affiliate marketing and potentially build a affiliate marketing website where you make a commission every time you promote a product, I'll leave some videos up on the screen that are completely free for you to watch right now. You can click them right now on the right and I'll take you through to those videos. Don't forget to subscribe, tap that notification bell, leave a comment below if you have any questions and I'll see you in the next video.